Hey guys, Anik is back here with another episode. In the last episode, we managed to beat Elite Four Drake. And in this episode, we're going to be versing Elite Four Champion. Oh, bloody Steven. I do have Budge up in front because he's going to be using Skarmory. I'm thinking, um, I'm debating about using a Thunder because his weakness is Fire and Electric. But I feel like if, if he he's going to lay down the Spikes because I versed him in um, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire and he always lays down the Spikes first. But if we can hit him with the Thunder, that should be able to one-shot him. Um, but although Skarmory does have a lot of defense, and I'm worried that Budge is actually going to miss this. Okay, he didn't miss. He did not miss. Can we one-shot him? I hope we can one-shot him. Okay, good. Good. We one-shotted him. Those spikes are not going to be a problem. Budge has not been touched. Okay, who's next? Who's next? Come on. Agron. Okay, I'm going to go straight for... I'm going to go straight for Buller. Hopefully, Buller can... I doubt Buller will one-shot him, because Agron is more... Has more defense than Skarmory. So let's go straight for the Earthquake and see how much damage that can do. I'm hoping it gets him to around about half health so we can just use it again and then Agron will be down. Okay, good. Half health, that's what I wanted. Earthquake, this should do this should not do too much because we're a grass type and Grand does not do too much damage to um, grass types. Now that's two Pokemon down in about one minute. Is that a world record or what? Oh my god! Okay, next Pokemon, I don't know what it's going to be. I know it's, I know it's po like all of his Pokemon, I just don't know who he's going to send out next. Okay, Cradilly. Um. Okay, I'm going to use... I'm going to use Burst for this, and I'm going to go hit the Blizzard. Use the Blizzard, hopefully that the Blizzard can at least one-shot him. I doubt it will, though, because he's a Rock-type and a Grass-type, but we shall find out. Okay, it hit. How much damage will it do? Come on. Half health? I wanted to get to half health so I can use it again. Okay, that's great. That's great. Giga Drain, that should that's, that shouldn't do too much, although he is six levels higher than we are. That did pretty good damage, but we should able we should be able to take it out now. He has used no full restores. We sh we should take him out now. Okay, good, we have taken him out. Three Pokemon to go. And we also got a level up. Yay! Love it! Okay, who's next? Who's next? Claydol. Okay. I'm gonna send out Iricus for this because Iricus is a gross type and he sh and he he has a, a lot of attack. His his attack stat his attack stat is very very high. And also Claydol is a sub. Claydol is a psychic type, so I want to use the Shadow Ball. See how much damage Shadow Ball does. He's gonna use the light screen, which isn't that great. I don't know if it's gonna affect our Shadow Ball, but I'm pretty sure it might. It does not, and I believe we are faster than Claydol, and he should not be using Full Restore. Okay, Earthquake, that should not take us out, because Iricus is a very tanky Pokemon. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, good. Iricus, Iricus slipped. Whew, Iricus, you babe. Okay, I believe that is two more Pokemon down. Iricus gets a level up? No, okay, so this is... Oh, sh is this his last Pokemon? Okay, I'm going to use Buller and I'm going to set up the Earthquake. Because I feel like even if I use a Hyper Potion, Metagross is going to take a set one shot. He has two Pokemon left. So that means that Armaldo is his last one. I hope he doesn't take a set now. Okay, how much damage will this do? I feel like it's not going to do too much. Because, yeah. We might, we might be able to two-shot him. He's going to use the Hyper Beam. If we can take him out... I'm going to go for... I'm going to go straight to Burst, but I doubt he can take us out now. Okay, he took us out. Very, very surprising. I want to confuse him. However... Wait, no, no, no. No. He still needs time to recharge. This is a good chance for Iricus to use... Um, Shadow Ball. Must recharge. How much damage will Iricus do? If Iricus can take him out, Iricus is a god. Okay, that's okay. He has a Citrus Berry. He has a goddamn Citrus Berry. Okay. It didn't heal him too much, but if I could lay the curse, I was hoping that would miss. But if I could lay the curse, that would do so much damage. I want him to use Hyper Beam again. Oh, attack. Ro Shit. That's no good. Okay, I'm going to go for... I'm going to go for Sight, and then I'm going to use... Uh, I'm going to use Faker just to get that little bit of damage in. And I want him to use that Hyper Beam. I want him to use that Hyper Beam. Flinched. Okay, good. And I'm going to go for the Faint Attack. 
Hopefully this doesn't do too much. I hope it just gets to, to where... Okay, that's how much I want him at. And then I want to use that overheat. If I can use that overheat... And I'm gonna... Oh, wow! Okay, I'm gonna go for Burst. Burst, hopefully, is faster than uh, Metagross. But I'm gonna use the overheat. If this can take him out, I'm going to be so amazed. Please take him out. <sighs> okay, Metagross is down. I know who I'm sending out next, and I think we've won this one. Holy crap. We took down Metagross. Okay, Armaldo is next. Okay, Armaldo should not be too hard. I'm gonna... I'm gonna use Fina for this. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. I'm going to go... He's a bug type, which is, good, which is good. I'm going to use the future side just so we can do even more damage. And he should not do too much damage to me with the, uh, now. Ancient Power, that shouldn't do too much. I'm thinking I should use the light screen, but that should not take us out. With the, If he uses another one, that should not take us out. This should do a lot. Okay, that's okay, because then the future side's going to hit uh, in another couple of turns. I don't think this turn, I think maybe next turn? Okay, good. If it can hit this turn, that'd be great. I don't, th I have a feeling it won't, though. No fucking way. I didn't know that we would beat Steven that quickly. Holy crap. I'm, I'm just going, Jesus Christ. I didn't even know that we would beat Steven that easily. I thought Metagross was going to be tough. He actually took out, uh, I think, two of our Pokemon, which is just, wow. And I, didn't, I think I used all throughout that whole Elite Four or Pokemon League. I think I used about one revive because Drake took down um, one of my Pokemon. I think I used one revive. I think I still have 19 left. May, get back. You're not allowed in here, May. You're not a true champion. Ooh, jeez. I did not know we would be... With our team, our team... Okay, at the start, our team... Was was really bad. I can admit our team did not do too well. We we struggled on the second gym, and now we completely completely destroyed Steven. We one shot at a Skarmory who was seven levels higher than we were. Saving, don't turn off the power. What if they do? Our budge that we found, I can't remember where. Our Iricus, because Iricus commented that. Alfina, we got it from the wild. Um, X player we found in the cave. Sceptile being our starter Pokemon, and Psy was our second companion. Holy crap. Look at that. Easy. Easy. So I want to thank every single person that stuck by watching this thing, but our adventure isn't over yet. We still need to catch every single legendary that we can attain. So I hope that you guys did enjoy this episode. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode when I find out which Pokemon, which legendary Pokemon we are catching first.